Yeah. yeah, you're right. I did not see the bottom. Per yeah, I did not see the bottom person at all. all Whoops. Right. Yeah, that makes a lot more sense. I was thinking about it too. I was like, wait, I don't know if I'm saying is right. All right, so we have Rido versus Legit on stream now. Uh, later we'll get Sue and Elegant and then Kameme versus Wrath. Oh, that'll be all exciting. Uh -huh. So Duck Hunt versus Diddy Kong. You you saw this matchup back in Smash 4 with like a lot of the Japanese Duck Hunts playing against Zero. All right. I'm really I'm really not sure how this matchup goes. It was like one of those, oh, Duck Hunt does well just because he has all these projectiles. But again, once Duck Hunt get hit, like you were able to put on the pressure and honestly just edge guard the crap out of Duck Hunt. I mean, Duck Hunt, I feel like, is like one of those like most slept on characters in Ultimate, like in, in, in any game, really. You no, know? because his new, you don't see a lot of people play him because like it takes so much setup in order to play Duck Hunt correctly. You know. Yeah, and especially in this game, if like you want to play a setup character, there's, there's just better setup characters. All right, like, there, there's the Belmonts, which is Snake. easier. Snake, yeah. <laughs> the OG. Omar, to a certain extent. That's true, and so. Like, again, not a lot of people play Duck Hunt really anymore either, but Duck Hunt still has some scary tools because right. you get a lot of, you have like double Frisbee up air and it's just some disgusting conversions yeah. that you see Rido do all the time. And his can plays the best I've ever seen. Right. Like, I mean, can, can is insane just like in any version of the game. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, Gunman's always annoying. The, the discus is like busted in this game because like it hits like it's super hard for like having like no end lag, so you can like combo off of it. Yeah, like sh yeah, short hop clay pigeon, just quick damage. But actually, wait, what did he get hit? Did he get shot? He uh, the the camp blew up. Oh, okay. Yeah, taking that first stock here, Rido. Although he did have a lot of percent on him, he's still playing so good to like put the can around where he thinks legit will throw the banana down at him, so he won't have a free punish. Yep. Yep, throwing him near the can, but not going to get a good can conversion. There oh, we go. He tries to go for the can setup again, or the yeah. frisbee setup. I mean, can you imagine? There was a point where that was even more busted. True. They, 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 they nerfed that because they realized, okay, we don't want double Frisbee into that at, like, 100% range, you know? I mean, yeah, you can still see it happen, though. Right. It's a, it happens at, like, the lower percents, but, like, not quite at the, the 60 to, like, 80% that legit was at. Mm -hmm. Oh, guess that up smash read. Yeah, a lot of uh, Duck Hunt smash hacks, they really have to be hard read because they're not like, oh, free throw and neutral. Right. So right now, Rido actually have three stocks to one, 140%. I mean, Duck Hunt Smash Attacks, they're basically like, I am going to kill you if this hits move. Yeah, hard read. You're going to be here. Yeah. So two stocks on Rido. Legit needs to find his way into it. It's not looking like he's being able to crack this code that is Duck Hunt. He's not having the most efficient way of getting around these setups. He's just kind of throwing himself at Rido and trying to get these uh, conversions. All right. Because I feel like a Diddy Kong's like main battle plan is like, okay, let me pull out banana and then approach with banana, you know, or uh -huh. throw throw banana at that. But yeah. then you have Duck Hunt throwing like all these projectiles in your face and be like, I don't even have enough time to to pull out banana, let alone throw it in neutral. Mm -hmm. So you know, it's all about like Diddy's like, okay, like you saw him right there. He tried throwing banana and like it got stuffed out by something. It actually hit the can, which hit the gunman, which extended to actually blow up Rido, and that right. was a that was a cool interaction. And so, again, you usually see Diddy with these, like, I'm going to hold banana and shield, and that's my neutral. But right here, it doesn't really work as often because you have to maneuver a lot, a lot more things. Right. And especially the way Rido plays, like you said. He puts himself near the can, so he can't get hit by freak banana conversions. And again, shielding Taking so that. much unnecessary damage from this can. He's just trying yeah. to find his way in, but the can is blowing him up almost every single time. I mean, it's so hard to find your way in because, like, there's all these projectiles, like, getting in the way of your, your banana setups. Nair not going to kill just yet. Yeah, see, he couldn't even go for just a run-up up smash. Right. Killing, not even killing Duck Hunt, but just killing Legit right there. Yeah. Rido with a two-stock. Again, he's not able to just safely get in and hit Rido without taking percent. Right. Karen is basically, like, a better grenade, in my opinion. Like, a snake, snake grenades, like, imagine, like, the only reason why snake grenades are, like, really annoying is because you can pull two of them at once. So, like... You, you have to deal with, like, twice the amount of space as, like, Duck Hunt can. But, like, imagine, like, if you had Duck Hunt can, which, like, you can kick forward and backwards. Like, uh, it's annoying. Yeah, I think it's, like, a real diff. It's, like, what you prefer? Because, like, grenades are good at, like, locking off space, getting that damage, getting out of combos. Where can is, like, I also want to get off combos. But can is also, like, something that you'll kill with. Right. So it's really just what you prefer. And I there, there could be a case for, like, can being better than grenade. So I can see what you mean. Right. So game two going to go over to PS2. I like this idea, legit. We what we've seen earlier, he was doing really well on this stage. He has so much room to just 
get his combos and just fly around like Diddy likes to do. Trying to space out with that fair. But unfortunately, Rado again, he's just putting up this, this such a good wall. All right. And you know, like, like with grenades, you know, Duck Hunt doesn't really care if he gets blown up by his own can because it's not going to kill him unless he's at like super high percent. But if it does hit and it trades, then like all of a sudden, like Duck Hunt can like combo off of it if they like, if they both trade with it at the same time. You see Ryder with that classic call up. A lot of Diddy players like to monkey flip high. We saw that was the bane of zero and he just got caught with it immediately with that up air. I know where you're going to be. Yeah. Oh, you saw uh, Legit trying to go for a down tilt up smash right there now that the can was away. But Ryder kind of seeing through that, be like, no, I'm going to, I'm going to hold back a little bit. And you know, not approach you, not trying to call your landing right there. Mm -hmm. And just see all the shield pressure, you know, like and legit, just like I can't hold the shield forever, so I gotta let it drop at some point. So right now, legit is still looking for that kill, but he's not able to get that just basic banana down tilt up smash. Oh, don't even throw that banana at me. I know that's... Uh, I'll hit you for that. Yeah. And there, Oh, he tried getting the up air again, but gets the can Throws combo. him into the can? No, barely going, but look how much space he made. Look how much he made legit retreat into the blast zone. All right. Back throw, quick. not going to kill him just yet. And then quick glitch trap. Not going to be able to find, find the grab, but gets a pigeon throw. Oh, missing the tech. Actually going to get an air for it. Tries to call him out with the up air. The up air. The, yeah, the up air again. We're getting that down tilt fair, gonna take off the first stock, but 130%, that is nothing to scoff at. You really need to be mindful of that can, because sooner or later it's gonna blow you up and take your whole stock. All right. And the fact that you can use Gunman to kind of hit the can too, means that, you know, like, even if the can is in your possession, it's not gonna be in your possession for long. Mm -hmm. Why are just so good at, like, dealing with the can? He's able to play around and just, like, you know, press the B button and then continue to walk around. You know, legit definitely showing a, a lot of improvement from the first game. I feel like he's finally getting used to can and finding like, okay, this is when I can go in now. Yeah, oh he tried to he tried to be really respectful of the can and then once he got pressure tried to jump over, but right again with that up air, he just has these reads on legit. Okay, we got combos, double jump up air, no jump on legit. Right. Fifty two percent, so much damage. Up till trying looking for something, but not going to be a fight. But it gets blown up in the face by the can instead. And you know what? This is legit. Like just trying to find his way in, but gets big, the forward smash. Yeah, big charge on the F smash, but still not going to kill. Right. So close. You know, legit really wanted that one to kill, so he could at least even this back up. Hundred percent. Right. It's starting to look like curtains for Rido. I mean, not for Rido, for legit. Yeah. Oh, forward air. The duck just going to poke him out of there. Ryder right, gonna take that 2-0 to move on to winner's semifinals. All right. Yeah, really clean stuff from Ryder.